President Xi Jinping began his journey at the Hunan First Normal University in the city of Changsha. This historic institution educated many of China's revolutionary leaders, including the late chairman Mao Zedong. Yang Dan, who manages the university's historic displays, says President Xi's visit highlights the importance of ideological and political education. The president's visit today is very inspiring. This is a university, a place where new quality productive forces are born. It's also a university that trains teachers. In addition, this is a revolutionary memorial site, where graduates went on to change the history of China and the world. Such traditions provide an important moral guidance for young people, as they carry the torch to revitalize our motherland. As China develops its new quality productive forces, there is a growing demand for innovative talent, and education is the key to cultivating a skilled workforce. With the encouragement of the country's top leader, this historic university will continue to nurture young minds, who will become the backbone of China's modernization. President Xi then visited Bas Shenshan, a joint venture between a German chemical giant and a leading Chinese battery materials manufacturer. The company is feeding an increasing demand for battery cells used in electric vehicles and mobile devices. In a brief interaction with the president, Dr. Tan Xinxin explained his latest research on battery safety. The president seemed very interested in our advanced equipment. He asked if it was imported. I said we bought it from Japan many years ago, but nowadays domestically produced equipment can achieve the same results. He was quite pleased and nodded. China is home to the world's largest battery manufacturing supply chain, covering materials research and development, as well as battery production and recycling. New energy is one of the most important industries in the world right now. Our work is closely related to the global pursuit of a greener future and China's own carbon goals. We will continue to increase our research and development investment and meet the needs of global consumers. Cutting-edge technology is the key to upgrading China's industrial hinterland. And the president's visit to this international joint venture underscores China's commitment for global engagement. Despite geopolitical challenges, China's market and expertise in advanced materials are poised to drive growth in the global new energy sector.